Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to SL Prime. Today I'm going to talk about the iPhone SE 2020 battery life. Is it good enough for you or maybe should you consider buying a different phone? Well, number one, if you're a basic user and you don't do a lot of gaming such as PUBG or older titles like Infinity Blade or Fortnite or whatever, if you don't do any of that, then you should be good. And also, if you plan on doing 4K video recording, 60 fps which you can actually do in this phone then you should probably should not get this phone because the camera actually drains the battery quite significantly especially if you're doing 4k video recording but if you're doing basic tasks such as launch pad making music garage band or whatever like text messaging phone calling using the maps using instagram you, sh you should have a pretty okay time Okay, let me show you an example of my usage scenario. So this is actually a balanced usage, a little bit of YouTube, a little bit of maps, a little bit of video recording, and I actually got 4 hours and 50 minutes. So this is pretty light, and of course I got 10 minutes left, so you can probably get around 5 hours total screen on time on this device. So if you're a little bit of a heavy user, and you use your phone for other tasks that are like gaming or video recording, then you might want to upgrade to a iPhone XR and it's not that much more expensive than the SE 2020 and it's still the pretty fast. Speaking of fast, this iPhone SE 2020 has the A13 Bionic, but is actually slower than the iPhone 11 Pro and Pro Max or just the 11 because the processor is actually a little bit slowed down because the SE has a tiny battery which is exactly on screen this much mah so apple's gotta decide okay we either need to somehow fit a bigger battery which nope they can't this is a pretty small device small footprint equals small battery and so they decided to basically down clock the processor so it's gonna run a little bit slower and be more power efficient so is this phone good enough Yes, in 2020 is good enough, but later down the road, as your phone ages, it's going to get worse and worse. So 5 hours may seem okay today, but in a few years, you might have a tough time. I'm serious. <laughs> right now, it could be 4 hours, but 3 years down the line, you might have 3 hours, which is pretty abysmal, and I would consider buying a different phone right now like i know right now it's okay but i really want to stress you guys to actually buy a bigger phone unless you absolutely need this small form factor in which some of you guys i know you probably want to get a smaller phone but if you can if you can spend a little more and get a slightly bigger phone such as the iphone xr because you want a phone that lasts long but yeah that's about it guys hope you guys enjoyed the short video today and i hope you guys subscribe we're trying to get to 2000 subscribers by the end of this week and see you guys later peace